Okay, hey guys. Hey, um, this is a review on my little scan disc. Um, I've had this for about a week now. It works great. Um, to be honest with you, man, I've got, I think this is a second gen. I think this is second gen iPod. Um, so that, I mean, that kind of puts it, if you've ever, if you have a second gen, there's the thickness, that's the difference in thickness. Um, the, obviously the height and stuff is a lot different. I mean, you know, um, one of the best parts, the thing I like about this is the music quality is very good, uh, even better than it was on my iPod. The bass sounds better, and when I hook it up to my Sennheisers, uh, uh, what are these, uh, HD 202s, um, you know, wrapping ears, very comfortable. Man, I put on some trance or some techno or something, or, you know, some really heavy metal b uh, bass or um, really ho strong rap or something, and it sounds amazing. Um, better than my iPod, a hundred times better. So, enough of this crap. Um, I didn't buy a case for this. The reason is, it's got the little clip, and to be honest with you, I don't really use cases. I had a case for my iPod. And I used it for like the first week, and then I was just like, this is stupid, why do I have a case? Uh, I'll start this up here real quick. Um, you can see the startup screen if you really want to. That's it. Look at you're up and going already. Um, I've got it. You can't really see this very well. Let me see if this will autofocus it. No, I don't think it's going to. Okay, well, it's not autofocusing it, so. I do, I have the shuffle and the repeat on. I have those on because um, I, when I work, I push cards. Um, I just put play all. And uh, right now I've got 592 songs on here. This is the 4 gig model. I wish the white came in the 8 gig because I would have bought that. Uh, I just wanted the white to be honest with you. I don't know why I just did. Um, let's see, my battery life is almost a halfway. And to be honest with you, at halfway, the battery goes by very fast. If you get, like, you'll probably get, like, eight hours out of the first half, and probably only, like, two hours out of the second half. It goes by very, very fast. Um, I think that was kind of a design flaw, software flaw, on Sansa's scan disk's part. They probably should have, you know, made that more equal, um, or at least made the bar read better, um, and to be honest with you, the biggest thing I've noticed, okay, so say, so like I'm listening to a song right now, and instead of, what you have to do is you can't, like, you can't go back, like, on your, on an iPod, you can't just, like, you know, click the menu button or whatever up here, you either gotta click the down button that says back to music list, okay, and that'll bring you back to the music list, and then you can just go back through it, just like, here's at the main screen. Alright, or what I like to do now is I just click the home button and it brings you right back to the main section. Just click home, brings you right back here. Uh, FM radio voice settings. Um, what I've noticed is that in these settings you got all sorts of stuff. Um, about the run of the time actually. You got music options, all sorts of stuff. Rate the song, repeat shuffle, the EQ, the replay delete a song, track info, all sorts of stuff in there. But what uh, one thing that kind of annoys me is when I hook it up, uh, the charging thing on the computer doesn't say it's charged, but it is. So make sure you unhook and rehook it back.